we know how much the kids love to see the fire trucks. So we thought during the quarantine, why don't we just bring the trucks to you? Follow along and see all the tools that firefighters and paramedics use on the job. We keep our fire gear hanging in an easy to reach spot on the truck to get ready quickly for a fire. Paramedics work in the back of the ambulance to help people when they're hurt or sick. We have lots of different medical tools to use in an emergency. And we keep it all close so we can reach it quickly. We check the ambulance and fire trucks every day to make sure that they're stocked and ready to go for the day. We clean our ambulances inside and out every day to make sure that they are clean for our patients when they're sick. It's especially important to keep our equipment and trucks in good shape in case of an emergency. It's important to remember that even though firefighters wear lots of gear to protect them in a fire, firefighters aren't scary. And here you can see a firefighter getting ready right now. First he puts on his boots and then his pants. His coat goes over his hood. Make sure everything is secured and then we put our air pack on. Finally we have our mask and our helmet. It's really strong so in case things fall it won't hurt us. Let's go take a look at the tower truck. This truck is for fighting fire in tall buildings. This is where the firefighters sit when we're driving to a fire. We wear air packs in order to breathe in a smoky building. We train with all of our trucks regularly. One of our firefighters is training in the bucket. Today we're training on the tower truck. The tower truck has big legs called outriggers that are used to keep the truck still while we climb the ladder. The tower truck has tools for us to use for lots of different jobs. We always make sure to use safety equipment and helmets when using the tower truck. Fans are used to help clear a building of smoke after we put the fire out. We have lots of rescue tools like ropes and different rigging equipment. Lights can also help brighten the scene that firefighters are working while in the dark. We hope you enjoyed our walkthrough video. Stay tuned for more content in the future. And most importantly, stay safe.